What's up guys, Rolf here, and today I'm going a brand new video, and today within this video I'm going to be kickstarting a new series here on my channel, playing FIFA. This is going to be called Nelson's Journey, and today I'm going to be explaining the rules to you whilst doing the first episode. So, the rules are as follows. So, obviously this series is completely based around Nelson Oliveira, his informed striker card, and if he gets any further informs along the way during the season, then of course I'll upgrade them to him. But, anyway, this season, is uh, this series is totally going to be based around our performance as a team, and then integrating football challenges down at the park where I'm going to bring friends in and do some myself that is going to help us upgrade the team and produce quite a good team uh, as good as a team as we can with all the upgrades we get so how the series is going to work is we're going to play two games an episode uh, the first game will uh, be the start of the episode as uh, uh, on the normal episode but of course we've got to run through the rules on this one so we'll play the first game if we win it uh, we'll get to add one player to the team if we lose we add no players to the team if we get a hat trick we add two players to the team and if we win by three or more goals we get to add three players to the team so how we decide on who we add to the team is then uh, when we bring the real life football challenge into the video so down the park I've already recorded this challenge and I know the results of it but if you have five attempts at doing whatever the challenge is and today it will be the crossbar challenge so attempt one will if you hit the crossbar on attempt one you get any special cards or the or any of the blow options and then attempt two is any league that you want to add the player in attempt three is the Premier League attempt four is uh, attempt four is the league of UVA attempt five is the Bundesliga and then if you get no if you don't hit it at all you get to add in a championship player so that's how this series is going to work I'm sure it doesn't make too much sense at the moment but as we go through episodes it'll make more and more sense and the rule cards on the screen will always be there at the end of each game to let you guys know what we get to add in and uh, what league or what player we are adding in and how many players we're going to add in so it will make more sense as you guys watch through the episodes and without further ado guys let's get into the first game so seeing as i've started this series quite late on in fifa i don't expect it to get that many views at all it's just something i wanted to do and upload to my youtube channel as i'm enjoying playing football at the park at the moment i thought it'd be a good idea to add something to my youtube channel um we're starting off in division five uh i haven't really played that much fifa this year at all so hopefully we can progress through more divisions and get to that division one and win that that's obviously the goal of the series and hopefully we can do that I'll be really really good if we can and without further ado guys like I said let's get into the first game so the team we'll actually be starting with is as follows it's the full Norris squad we've got John Ruddy in goal Tim Close in centre back partner with Basong then we've got Mitchell Dykes in left back Evo Pinto right back the two centre defensive mids are Alex Tetti and Yusuf Malumbu the cams are Wes Hulhan and obviously Stephen Naismith and then up front we have Inform Oliveira and Cameron Jerome so the team isn't that good at the moment and and obviously our goal is going to be to upgrade it to a lot better of a team whilst keeping Oliveira in there we can change up formations do whatever we sort of want of course at the moment we um, have have options on the bench that we can't really use we can only use if they if they get injuries but then eventually we'll be able to bring more players into the side bring them onto the bench have our Norwich players uh, subbed out it'll be really really good and hopefully it'll work quite well going forward so this is the team we're up against in the first episode he has De Gea in goal uh, Winston Reed in centre back right back Mark, uh, Klein uh, Masaku left back Emre Chan. Uh, Ericsson, Sadio Mane, Lucas Perez, Depay, and uh, I can't remember who that is. The, Wol uh, the Wolves player. Or both the Wolves player, in fact. But it looks like a team we can definitely go ahead and beat. Hopefully, we can do so. And without further ado, guys, let's get straight into it. Alex Teddy's slow. <laughs> Alex Teddy's really slow. Don't let him get the shot off. Don't let him get the shot. Oh, no. No. Yeah. Thank God, Ruddy. That was awful by me. Awful defending. Go on then, Oliveira. His first sort of spell on the ball, see what he can do. Just a simple layoff, takes it back, T takes it round Masaku. Go on, Oliveira. Oh, the first shot there with Oliveira, he seemed quite good actually, he seemed quite well good on the ball. Mitchell Dykes takes a corner. Go on. Oh, Jerome, Oliveira. Oh, that was so close. Go on closer, same again from you. Well, I'm Mitchell Dykes. Oh, no, no, no. Block the shot. Block the shot. No way! We've been all over him. That's not good. Definitely not good. I don't know. That was good. Then we just had to get it clear, but it played a good tackle on us, to be fair. And then the, keep, the shot's gone straight under the keeper. That's really annoying. But hopefully we can claw it back. We have been sort of over on this game, so... And only half an hour in, so we've definitely got time to go and get a goal back. Malumbu. Feeds Teddy. 
Duran. Oh, no. Well done, Cameron. Go on, get it in. Oh, no, it's come off the bar. The song was good. No, Teddy. Teddy Mulumbu was completely free at the back there. Why has Closer gone into that? I'm going to try to juke it, bait him out with the keeper. Go on, Ruddy. Go on, Ruddy. No. 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 Oh, no. We do not deserve this at all. The defence is terrible, to be honest. <laughs> we definitely need to improve the defence. But it doesn't look like we're going to be able to if we don't win this game. Yes, Olivier. Go. 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 Jerome. Jerome. You're through. You've just got one man to beat. That's a foul. Yeah, I was going to say. If we can get across in here, we can hopefully pull the goal back from here. So that will be good. We'll be alright going into the second half. Shit cross. Naismith. Oh, for God's sake. Right. Going into half time, we are 2 0 down. We don't really deserve it, to be totally honest. Just the defence. We've been caught uh, a couple times at the back and haven't really been able to uh, stop the goal at all. But. Yeah, every time they sort of go forward, they seem to score. But we have had three shots on target. We've sort of had uh, most, uh, well, a bit more of possession. We've on 53%, which is all right. But in the second half, I really want to go out here and at least scrape a draw, if not a win. Chase him. Keep chasing. He's going to try to turn us. Well on, Tessie. Go on. Oh, my God. How have we done that? Malumbu. Tessie. Oh, no. Oh, what are we doing? I can't believe we haven't scored there. What has gone on? Well done, Ruddy. Bloody hell. If we'd have conceded there, that'd been game over. Go on, Jerome. Go on, Jerome. Oh, no. I should have done better there. Mitchell Dykes with the corner. Oliveira. I don't. I. Wes. What is going on? Naismith. Takes a touch pass. Gone. No, oh, no, Malumbu. I thought that was it. No, 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 no. Block the shot. Block the shot. Yes, well done, Ruddy. Oh, Jesus Christ. I was nervous then. Go on, Jerome. We're taking it past. Right, it's it's sort of a 2 on one It's now lo no longer a 2 on one Go on, Oliviera. Oh, he's cleared off the line. No way. This is so unlucky. Like, it's just not our day. Right, Oliviera, turn him, turn him. Well done. That's a good play, that. Go on, one more ball through. Jerome, Jerome! Yes! 2-1! Come on, we've still got a fight in this. A couple of minutes left, but if we get the ball again, we just need one more attack and we can do this. Come on. Go on, Dykes. Go on, Dykes. Play him! Jerome! Jerome! Yes! <laughs> We've gone and done it. Jerome with the double. This shouldn't even be a Liviera series. Jerome's been fantastic. Yes, get in. That's really good. That's really, really good. Yes, get in. First game of the episode, we come up against quite a strong team. And we go and pull the draw. Realistically, I think we could have got more out of that if we'd have taken our opportunities. And we're a bit unlucky with the block off the line, but it has gone quite well. At the beginning of the series, I've, I've just remembered, I forgot to say what happened if uh, if there was a draw. And a draw is going to allow me to like still add a player in, but I can only add in one player whether I get a hat-trick or not. It doesn't matter, but I can add in one player and that's it if I get a draw. So now let's go ahead and jump into the um, challenge of the episode, which is going to be the free kit, uh, the crossbar challenge. Hopefully we can hit the crossbar and get a good player added into, into the team to go. Here we are guys with the first attempt. Hopefully we can get it quite early on so we get a good, a better player to upgrade our team with. We've actually gone and got it in the second attempt, guys, which is actually really good. Uh, happy with that. Thought it was going to take a bit longer than that, but that's actually really good. Straight back into the second game now. See who we get as an upgrade to our team. So, guys, as you've just seen, we've actually gone and hit the crossbar on the second attempt, and that means we get to add in any player from any league. It can't be a special card, though. So, taking a look at the team, personally, I think we performed quite well on the attack. Definitely, we can improve it going into the future, but I think we sort of struggled in the defence. I thought Team Close was pretty solid, and actual, actually, Mitchell Dykes went, uh, went and got man of the match in the last episode, even though Jerome did score two goals. So, and Evo Pinner for me was quite good. So, I think we're going to go ahead and replace 
Christmas song with a championship centre back. I know we can add in a better centre back than that. But for me, if we go ahead and add in some something on the likes of Chris Smalling, he's not going to link up with any players and won't get a lot of chemistry. So I think we might as well go and dive into the championship and see what centre-backs there are to add in. Of course, we're going to go for the gold quality. We want to get a good centre-back, see what centre-backs there are, and hopefully we can get someone good. So obviously, Mbemba uh, on FIFA last year, if that's how you say his name, was quite a solid player. And I quite enjoyed using him on my team, to be honest. And then you've got Ojoa, which is also quite good. Mika Richards, who also looks very strong this year, to be totally honest. Uh, so, there's three centre-backs there that I'm quite li liking the look of. Uh, Mbem Mbemba, however you say his name. Onjoa, and then Mika Richards. For me, I think it's between either Mbemba or Mika Richards. And I'm going to go ahead and decide to get... Mbemba. I just sort of like his stats. I think he's quite fast, which is good. And then we've got the strength as well as the defensive abilities, which I think will come into hand quite well, partnered with Tim Close, as he's quite a slow centre-back. So we're going to go ahead, see how cheap we can find um, Mbemba for, if that's... Um, I probably sound so stupid saying his name, but... We need to go ahead and sign this guy as he does look quite good and I think he will actually help our team going forward. So here we are guys, adding Mbemba into the team. We've actually got some good centre-backs who we could use further on into the series when we get to unlock these players like Chris Morning, Mustafi and obviously the um, the actual special club Kulabali who I got off a squad builder showdown challenge which was quite good. So hopefully we'll get to use them in the future but today we're going to be adding Mbemba into the squad. Hopefully he can improve us defensively and without further ado guys, let's get into the second game of the episode. So here we are guys. In the second episode of the series, uh, second game of this episode, sorry, we come up against a good, uh, quite a good team here. This guy does seem a lot better than the other guy though that we just played, so it could be quite a hard match. Well done, close. Close is all over the place. It's brilliant. I want to. No, I. That's my fault. I sort of turned away from him. Go on, Oliveira. This could be a great first goal for him. Go on, Oliveira. <laughs> what a goal! I've absolutely destroyed them. I've gone through all of them. That's a brilliant goal. Oh my god. That's awesome. What a player. What a player. Look at that. Turn in here, do him, and then take the shot off the bar into the top right hand corner. That's a brilliant goal. And what a first goal for him in this series. The Vieira turns in, take inside. You won't expect it. Feed Jerome in. Just that ball needed to be in front of him so he could run onto it. But Jerome's still on it. Left foot shot. Oh, no. Out for a corner? No, not quite. But that's good again. We're showing a lot of presence here with this team. Well done, Mitchell. What a tackle. Tackle again. Tim Close. Brilliant. Go on, get on that. Well done, Roddy. Jesus Christ. What oh, a save. Well done, Mitchell Dykes again. I think that's a goal kick if that goes out. Yeah, it is. Well done. Don't let him run in. Well done, Wes. Another corner for him, though. They're piling on the pressure towards the end of the second half here. Hopefully, we can just prevent it, though. Bloody hell. How he hasn't scored that, I do not know. Oh, well done. That's a really, really good half. 1-0 up at the half. Uh, we are lower on possession, but it doesn't really matter. We've got the goal. Olivier with a great solo goal. Hopefully, we can keep the lead. Maybe get another goal just to save from things up at the back. And then get our first win of the series, which would be great. Give it to him. Teddy, shoot. Oh, no. Teddy would be scoring them, I mean, he would be. Stop the shot. No, 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 no. No way has that gone in. I can't believe that's gone in. I don't know if that was a deflection or not, but that, that's got to be a deflection. It was such a weak shot. Tiago as well. I hope that I... Oh, no. I don't know if that's Ruddy's fault or not. It's not a deflection either. I don't know what's happened. Yeah, it's just gone under the keeper. Oh... That sucks, but hopefully we can get another goal here and go on and win the game. Hopefully. Go on, Jerome. Go on, Jerome. That's a great goal. Another great goal by Jerome. Him and Oliveira, I'm loving them two up front. I honestly don't think I'll change them for a while. There's no need to. They're scoring goals and doing the job they're, they're required to do, to be honest. 
That's really good. A good turn there, showing his strength, then pace away and finish another top right hand corner goal. That's brilliant. Mbemba. Oh shit. Closer. Mitchell Dykes. No! I've get I've get it. Oh no. I've let them straight back into the game. Jermaine Defoe with the finish. I, I, that's my fault, because here I didn't need to take Mbemba out of position, I just needed to hold him, but now he's... That's, that sucks. That really does suck. Hopefully we can get another goal, though. I'm going to go attack him, try and get this goal for us. Oh, almost broke through the hole. Go on, join. <laughs> no, I thought I was in! How's he missed that? Has he saved it? He saved it. I'm going to take the corner with Wes instead of uh, Mitchell Dykes, because he's quite a presence in the box. Jesus Christ, that was deep. Go on, Malumbu. I've, I've messed it right up. I don't know why I've done that. I should have just shot, not taken it around him. Chipped the keeper or something. Just not what i done. Shit. No, 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 no. Well done, Mitchell Dykes. Stop it. Stop it. No, oh, God. Yes. <laughs> right. I can't believe they haven't scored there. That was so lucky. Please, not now. Please, 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 please. Yes. Yes, Ruddy. <laughs> that was lucky. Oh, another draw in the episode. Another 2-2 draw. But uh, once again, we deserved the win, I think. And we went in front both times and then they've come back, which is unfortunate. But another good game there from the, from the team. We're going to go into the challenge. Uh, whatever happens, though, we're going to have to add in a... Um, yeah, only one player. So hopefully we can get another good, uh, another good round on the challenge and see what happens, and hopefully add in another good player. But other than that, I'm happy with the result though. But we do need to start picking up points as we are in Division Five, so there's quite a lot of points you need to go up. Nelson Oliveira with his first man of the match for the club, which is a good thing. But hopefully we'll get something good from the challenge and add another good player into this team. So now we've finished the second game, guys. We're going to be going in and jumping into doing the half volleys or volleys hopefully we can do quite well in this one and hopefully hit the crossbar as fast as we did in the first challenge anyway let's get straight into it that was absolutely shit that was garbage right. Oh, that was so close! That was so close. That's really in the win. Go on. Oh, that was really close, but we've done it right there, quite close. Two more attempts, let's go again. Here we are, guys, with the fourth attempt, the second to last attempt. Hopefully, we can hit the crossbar. Let's see what we can do here. That's, that's awful. Is it? Oh. <laughs> We've actually got quite close to be honest. Now with the fifth attempt, if we don't hit this, then it's not gone too well, but it is quite a hard challenge. So hopefully we can hit it. <laughs> oh, that was great. That was actually awful. But anyway guys, hopefully you enjoyed the challenge. Let's get back into the video and see what players we have to add in. So, there we are guys, the challenges are now done for this episode. Hopefully you did enjoy it, like I said. But now, we didn't unfortunately hit the crossbar on that attempt, but we are going to add in a championship player, seeing as those are the requirements. So, taking a look at the team, personally, I really like both Malumbu and um, Alex Tetti. Stephen Naismith, for me, is playing okay. So is Wes Hulan. The strikers up front are doing fine. Mitchell Dykes has been brilliant. Close has been awesome. And Bemba's been really good. Pinto's been fine. John Ruddy's been all right. But I'm going to, for me, I'm going to go ahead and take Stephen Naismith out of the team and see what we can add into the team. Obviously, we can always add him back in. Only a championship player, though. So we're going to go ahead here and see what cams there are to add in in the championship. Hopefully, there's a decent one. Uh, we'll see what what options we do have available though I do need to set it to the correct lead though otherwise it's not going to work is it but let's see what options we have available Diame looks quite good uh, Cabano looks 
also pretty decent to be totally honest. Hernandez has all round good stats. Um, what other options are there? There must be other options. Come on. What else is there? Um, by the looks of things, there's not another option. So, personally, I think I'm going to go ahead and add in Diame into the team and see what happens there. But, like I said, we always have that option to bring uh, Naismith back into the side. Hopefully, we'll be able to uh, after we've seen if Diame plays well or not. But, yeah. So, we're going to go ahead here and add Mia, uh, Mohamed Diame into the team. We're going to go ahead here, take Naismith out of the team, we'll put Team Crawl up there and then remove him from the squad. And then as soon as we've done that, we're going to go ahead and DM ahead and add in Diame. Unfortunately, I can't speak today. This is ridiculous. But there we are, guys. Diame's in the squad now. That looks like quite a good team. We've made a couple of good improvements here. I'm really excited to continue using him in Bemba and see how he plays for us. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. Like I said, guys, any improvements, let me know down in the comment section down below. Thanks so much for watching, and be sure to see you guys in my next video.